I'm going to read you a story. The treasure chest. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, this is gorgeous. Yeah. And I wonder what's inside on this treasure chest. The treasure chest. Every week, Mrs. May took some of the children to the swimming pool. The children were good swimmers, and they liked going with Mrs. May. The children were taking a swimming test. It's time to begin," said Mrs. May. "Who wants to go first? We do," said Madame. Beth, Chub, Woman, Madame jumped into the pool. The water was warm. Off to go," called Mrs. May. They had to swim up and down to the pool. They had to swim ten lengths. Wilma was first to swim in ten lengths, and Beth and Nadine were next. It was hard for Chip to swim in ten lengths. Come on, Chip! Called Mrs. May. Don't stop. This is the last length. Length. So Chip went to on, and everyone was pleased.、Hmm. Next, they had to swim on the bottom of the pool. They had to pick pick up a brick, swim, and swim in with the pop. All the children passed the swimming test. Mrs. May was very pleased. Well done, everyone," she said. The children were pleased too. Ooh, so eight hundred going and up with the box, and everyone passed. Oh, well, be very congratulations if somebody else passed. Beth and Chip told told Ma told. Told mom and dad about the swimming test. We passed, they said. Mom and dad were very pleased too. Mom and dad was a surprise for them. Oh, I wish there was a surprise for them. Beth and Chip couldn't wait. Wait, couldn't see what the surprise was. What is it? Asked Beth. Hmm, I don't know. It's a mystery. I love surprises. It was a fish tank," said said. "It's a fish tank," said Beth. "What a lovely surprise!" Everyone looked at the fish swimming about in the tank. There is room for more fish," said Dad. "We we can get some next time we go shopping." Oh, goody goody! Look at that! Wow! I really wish I have a tank like that. Can you make this into the song? I'm the piggy. <laughs> the next day, they went shopping. Dad took them to a shop that sold fish. What a lovely shop," said Beth. "Look at all the fish."、Hmm. Right, it's all for pets. There are big fish and little fish. Chipper liked the big fish in the tank. Don't tap the glass," said Dad. "The fish don't like it." Dad put some more fish in the tank. He put rocks on the bottom. Next to the rocks, he he put a Ship and a little box. Wilma and Nadine come to see the fish tank. It looks lovely," said Wilma. "I wish I can swim in there. <gasps> I really, really want to just, just, uh, just swim in there. But if, but Mom and Dad are going to take me a little to the sw- swimming, swimming pool." Oh, but it's so hard to go to the swimming pool because there's just no food. They want to play in the boys' room. 
trip ran in with a map feed of tea was growing. It's time for an adventure, said Biff. The magic began to work. It took the children into a new adventure. It is time. Time. It was a different sort of adventure. Hmm. Big, big adventure, I hope. <laughs> it came out. Well, just check it out, yes. The magic took them underwater. Did you swim like this or this? I swim like this. But if I have some goggles, this will be more good. <laughs> the magic took them underwater. The children had had masks and flippers and tanks of air. They could swim underwater. Hmm. Press this to speak. Press this. Oh, cool. Goody, goody. One minute. I love pools, but, but I don't know it. Hmm. This. This. Starfish. Oh, starfish. Okay. The children loved swimming under the water. It was lovely to see all the fish in the stream and to swim with them. Chip and the team swam to the bottom and pick up a big shell Biff looked at a jellyfish but she didn't swim too close it's too dangerous she was too a bit on my hand and they got worse but I was pressing the clues and I went to the hospital but it was good because it wasn't a poison They swam up to the ship. They saw saw a ship under the water. It was an old ship that had been under the water for a long time. They swam up to the ship. Wilma didn't want to swim too close. It looked like it looked dangerous. <gasps> if I was Wilma, uh, we need to just see a bit under the sea. Don't you know? Dangerous. Oh no! <gasps> oh. Sorry, I was really, really was, was disappointed. Oh, this is very, very scary, Mommy. I knew it would be very fierce. They saw an octopus. Oh no, it was sitting in a chest. They couldn't look inside the chest with an octopus sitting in the lead. Ugh. Octopus? Ooh, I like eating octopus. Ooh, taste strange. Like a jelly, mm. but it isn't cold. Oh no! It looks mad. <laughs> now they blew bubbles at the octopus. The octopus didn't like the bubbles, so it swam away. Good. Hope the children now we can look inside. The children opened the chest and looked inside. There was a treasure chest in the it was full of gold <gasps> full of gold. <sighs> oh. Could 
First, I want to push the chest over, and all the gold fell out. They didn't pick up a napkin, and first picked up a gold cup. Mommy, <gasps> I can't breathe. <gasps> There's so many gold. Give me a hundred gold. I can't believe it. They were busy looking at the treasure. They didn't see what Chip and Wilma saw. A shark was coming. Chip and Wilma couldn't tell Biff and Adam. They pulled them away and pointed at the shark. Oh no, they're too busy looking at the shark. The children were frightened. They swam and swam, but the shark swam after them. The magic key began to glow. The magic key took them out of the adventure. Wow, what an adventure, said Biff. The treasure chest was light on our fish tank. Chip <gasps> is a mystery. The children ran to look in their fish tank. Look, there's the treasure, said Chip. How did it get there? asked Madame. It's magic, said Bill. 